Hi guys, welcome to my channel. My name is CKT Chaotic. Today I'll be reading The Remarried Empress, episode 182. After the test results were announced, Glorium was stripped of her title, and the nation's focus turned to the punishments of the swindling Empress and her accomplices. If His Majesty decides it decides to adopt the fake princess, there might be hope for her yet. But the entire empire was taken in by a heinous deception, making such a fairy tale outcome unlikely. Nevier. <laughs> Looking back, Nevier always attempted to discuss things with me. I was told that you found a slave during your hunting trip and brought her back. Please commute Viscount Landre's sentence and banish him instead. So that we could resolve matters with mature dialogue. I thought that was what you wanted. So I decided for to wait for you instead. Instead of letting me be driven by emotion. I was the one who shut her out. Never should I have listened to you. A little bit too late for that, sir. All the regrets. If I had, I probably wouldn't be suffering like this. <laughs> oh, he's so weird. Oh, he's just so weird. It's like crying at, against the portrait of them two. Like... Oh. I'm sorry, Nevier. Nevier. Girl has not slept. Gloria, not a princess? What about my baby? What happened to my daughter? Those are like... The lights are on, but nobody's there, stare. <laughs> Who knows? Wouldn't it be quicker if you looked into it yourself? Uh, are you kidding me? <laughs> You're shameless. How dare you deceive the emperor and hatch a cuckoo's egg? A cuck cuckoo? You dare call the princess a cuckoo? Oh. oh my god. Even if I did hatch a cuckoo's egg or the princess is a cuckoo, you're nothing but a worm. You're just a worm to be eaten, whether it's by a cuckoo or a lark. I'm still the empress. I can squash a mere worm like you. You. Erane. Erane. Huh? <laughs> Oh, dear. You should be careful. Duke Ergy? Why did you do it? Why did you do that to me? Do what, exactly? Disobey your request to kidnap your child and abandon him. Or... Perhaps you're referring to how I took him to the temple. Or maybe you're talking about these documents that will soon be made public. What? What is all of this? As the Empress of the Eastern Empire, I, Rasha Ishka, promised to hand over a port to Duke Ergi Cloud. It's about time you repaid your debt. <gasps> you were the one who offered to lend me the money in the first place. You didn't even set a deadline. Circumstances have changed since you're incapable of repaying me. <sighs> I'll have to inform the emperor before it's too late. Why are you doing this to me? 
You said you pitied me. Shouldn't you at least tell me the reason why? I know how you feel. Why is this person doing this to me? Why is this happening to me? It feels unfair when you don't know the reason. It's not like anything changes if you find out, but it just feels more unjust. <gasps> Evil bastard. Go to hell. <laughs> oh, I intend to. I even invited you to join me, didn't I? Don't worry. His eyes... I won't make you go alone. What does that mean? Oh, I know what he mean, meant, but that is just so... The Remarried Empress, episode 182. Meanwhile, in the Western Empire, Eastern Empire's Cuckoo Princess. Ah, I knew it! Something like this would happen! What a haughty and shameless woman! Laura! It was revealed to the world that the Salvation's precious princess is actually Alan Rimswell's daughter. And Russia already gave birth to another child in the past. How trashy. Salvation cast me aside. For a love this hollow? Your Majesty, Duke Reverdy requests an audience with you. Uh, Duke Reverdy? Let him in. Uh, there's something. I must give it to you urgently, Your Majesty. I told him I could walk on my own. Pl what do you plan to do? About the thing... About the... Duke Reverdy, uh, about the thing Duke Reverdy dropped off this after afternoon. As in the libelous message that woman wrote. I plan to make an unofficial complaint to the Eastern Empire. I see no reason to let this slide. Even if the reason Sovetiu gave for the divorce was true and I was indeed infertile, for now it's just a baseless rumor that I'm with Henry's child. The Duke gave this to me in spite of that. He likely wants me to forgive him because he regrets co colluding with the elder Duke Zemencia. An official complaint to the Eastern Empire. You're amazing, my queen. I'll make sure that everything is prepared perfectly. Meanwhile, at the manor in Comshire. You mean the future we secured at the cost of your sister's life? You would have us ally with the enemy for that? I won't do it. I refuse. What happened here that made father so opposed to the idea? That over there, huh? Was it so it was true? The Emperor locked Krista up and drove her to death? Krista, my sister. My one and only sister. I won't let you get away with this. I won't let you be happy. You pay for what you did. Emperor Henry. Oh my gosh. Well, we kind of knew that it's been way too happy in the Western Empire for a little bit too long and some drama, drama needs to come that way, but what is this guy going to do? And now Rasha, of course, don't really know the reason why people are doing this against her, but she now know her enemy's face. You know, like she thought all these people were her enemies, but truth was the one closest to her was the one backstabbing her this entire time. Wow. Look, in the end, I feel so bad for Gloria. I'm like, she 
doesn't deserve all that. And her brother, her, either her brother, full blood or half blood, Ian don't, does not deserve that either. And honestly, everyone, the whole nation, the whole empire knows Gloriam's name. So wherever she goes, people will shun her. Like, oh, you're the cuckoo's princess. You're the fake princess. You're, oh, she's going to go through a lot. That sucks. All right, guys. If you guys read ahead, please no spoilers for people who, have, who are reading this without, you know, using the tokens. But you guys are more than welcome to post in for me. Just put spoiler, spoiler alert, you know, enter, 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 enter. And then put the spoilers for people who do want to read it. Because I, I will read it regardless, like, you know. But anyways, if you guys enjoyed the way I read and reacted to this webtoon, feel free to subscribe, leave a thumbs up, drop some comments. Thank you so much for your support on my channel. Um, and I'll catch you guys next time. Bye!